do I regret getting my sister locks? Um... Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. So I'm just gonna be giving y'all a little lock update. Um, y'all know I got sister locks. Um, I said I was gonna look this up cause I don't remember the day I established my locks. So I got sister locks on May 21st of this year. So yeah, I started my locks on May 21st of this year and now we are in October. So that is six months. Is that six months? five months so yeah <laughs> so it has been five months so this is what my hair is looking like now i'm not sure y'all when i look at myself i just feel like i don't see any growth but i have to go back and look at videos to see i still like i have a lot of shrinkage as y'all can tell i still have to kind of like pull my hair out and um my locks are actually combined too so the last time i got my hair done she combined well the time before last <laughs> two reties ago she combined all of my locks and since she combined all my locks i noticed the last time when i got a retie that i didn't get as much slippage or locks coming out so um i was getting locks to slide out really bad around the perimeter of my hair like y'all i would come back for my appointment and i kid you not my edges would be out in the back of my hair those would come out and be sliding so that was kind of discouraging that was kind of getting on my nerves like i told my mom because my mom and my sister have sister locks if you guys did not know and i told my mom i was just like i did not know that i was gonna have to go through all this i kind of thought it was gonna be a i just get the locks and they grow and we flourish and all of that <laughs> and all of the things y'all but like my locks were sliding out to the point where it was like frustrating because i felt like i had like a fro in front of my head so as y'all can see um i just got a retie saturday and today is monday so it looks fresh Ooh. it looks fresh i might have slung a, a little bit of water on y'all because i do spritz my ends now someone had asked me and i think they asked me either one under one of my shorts or they might have asked me under one of my lock videos i can't remember um <clears throat> but um they asked me how do i get the ends of my hair straight the ends of my hair are not straight as y'all can see it's very much curly the ends of my hair is very much curly so the ends of my hair are not straight but what i do in the mornings like before i'm going to work this rose water and at this point it's rose water um and water mixed together when it got like halfway i filled the rest up with water so i do um i'm just gonna show y'all i will take like this and i will spray the ends of my hair in the morning and i will do that um all over um i pretty much do that every day you don't have to and then sometimes i will take this this is as y'all can see this is hawaiian silk miracle worker and it's 14 and one i actually got this from the beauty supply store before i moved pretty sure you can get it at any beauty supply store and i will just put this um on the ends of my hair as well and this is supposed to help with moisture um and and help enhance my curls as well so i use this and this beauty supply store for this i actually got this from sprout but i honestly don't know who else carries it so I do that and that just to help my curls and then also that I help my hair be flowy. Um, so at this point, I do want to like say whether I have been liking my hair or not liking my hair. So I'm going to be honest, y'all. Do I regret getting my sister locks? Um, I'm not going to say I regret getting them. I will say right now we have a love hate relationship um i am loving them since i did get my last retie and the reason why is because i didn't have as much slippage i don't even really think i had any slippage 
um, this time around. So, but my lock slipping out, y'all, was very frustrating. I feel like it had more to do with it being hot outside and me sweating in my scalp. And sometimes I do wear wigs over my locks just um, when I want to switch it up, I wear my wigs and I felt like when it was hot outside, that was really helping my locks slide out. Now, this last go around before I got my retie on Saturday, I still was wearing wigs as normal or I'll just wear my locks. I honestly switch it up, y'all. When I go to work, sometimes it's just the locks. Sometimes it's the wig. They just don't know what they're going to get. But um, I switch it up and um, I will say this last time, regardless of wearing my wigs or not, my locks did not slide out on my perimeter or the back of my hair where my hair is really, really soft. Um, and I think that had more to do with the weather and it cooling down more than anything. So um, with that being said, um, the only thing too that kind of bothers me, I feel like my hair is not as flowy as I would want and I'm just being real. Um, we got a little bit like, but for the most part, I feel like, you know, when oh, I got dizzy a little bit, you know how when people, uh, you know, everybody's locks are different. That's the thing. Everybody's locks are different. And what somebody else's locks are going to do or will do, mine potentially won't. I just feel like my hair is not as flowy. That may come with time or I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> but it may just be the texture of my hair too um like i said i do mist it with, with water in the morning um just to kind of give it a little bit of bounce to it because yeah <laughs> it'd be pretty much shaped the way it's shaped which i see that happen to a, a lot of people in the morning so that doesn't really bother me but i do kind of feel like my hair is just stiff so uh other than that i do like to switch it up sometimes like I'm gonna show y'all a picture. I had some up, some some down. Uh, yeah, I did like a some up, some down style this weekend. I be, for the most part, doing my middle part. I'm not really a side part type of girl. I don't know, not really a side part type of girl. But I've been guilty of not really styling my hair the way I want to. I'm guilty of waking up in the morning, not having enough time, just misting my hair with a little bit of water and going, cause sometimes, I just be rushing and not having time to style my hair so i wear it down a lot i may do like a ponytail be a little struggle ponytail y'all because my hair is short but yeah um what was i gonna say i didn't really show y'all the journey of when i first moved as you know i relocated since i started my locks so when i moved to charlotte i had to find someone else to do my hair that whole um like shopping around or not really shopping around but trying to find someone new to do my hair was a little stressful i did run into like some people not taking new clients they're offering for you to get on their wait list i'm like if i need my hair done now why would i get on your wait list you know so i mean i guess if you really want that person to do your hair but if i need my hair done now i'm trying to find somebody you know to do my hair now so I did that took a while I reached out to you know different people trying to get my hair done and then I did find someone to do my hair which y'all it was great and <laughs> and I was just happy to have you know that journey over but like I said this is what my hair is looking like y'all all of my locks are combined as you can see we're gonna do a little close-up because they're combined like at the root like these two are as you can see y'all uh, i have a few things going on so like my mom before i moved we were kind of playing around trying to see and my mom combined like four in the front so and she just twisted them together so this is how this is how this is done with just the way my mom combined it and then when the the girl who well the woman who is doing my locks now the way she combined them she just did uh at the root or whatever and but yeah they are all combined y'all honestly what i do love about my locks i do feel like my hair is always done now so if under my wigs if i wear a wig and i take my wig off my hair is done that's how i feel that's what i love i don't do like a lot of braid outs or anything like that because i felt like when i first got my locks i would attempt to do a braid out and i honestly felt like it accentuated the not fullness of my hair that i didn't like and i felt like the more i just kind of wet my ends and go about my day my hair looks more fuller 
um i don't know i may try a braid out now i have not tried a braid out in months but i just been kind of going with this look just wearing them curly so yeah i just wanted to show y'all still my locks um i just haven't really i haven't been really doing videos um kind of got thrown off a little bit but i'm gonna try to get back onto things but i did want to give an update of my hair and just show y'all what we looking like um we still got shrinkage look at that y'all so still got shrinkage and all of that but like we're at five months i'm trying to see when i should do another when should i do another check-in probably in the next like few months i'm not gonna do a, ch a check-in next month but i'm gonna let a few months go by when i get a little bit bit more length i'm gonna show y'all but i honestly have not really been being able to tell that my hair is growing besides <laughs> looking at old videos and i'm like okay yeah my hair did grow um and yeah so this is what we're looking like and yeah so yeah y'all that is honestly gonna wrap up this video if you started a lock journey and you are pretty new on if you have micro locks sister locks how many months have you had them what do you love like what are the pros and the cons you feel like of locks um have you been loving your locks like yeah so like i said i told y'all right now we just have a love hate but i will say right now because they have not been slipping out and driving me crazy slipping out um I have been loving them right now. So don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe and leave some more lock suggestion or lock video, lock video suggestions. I don't know, just leave some video suggestions in the comment section down below and I'll see y'all in the next one. Bye. Bye.